Hello friends, back to problem analysis. It's me Jesse. If you are interested in problem solving and if you know the basic geometry, basic properties of angles on circles and to find the area of sectors, then here is an interesting problem. Consider a rectangle with length is 4 units. Now two identical semicircles are placed inside the rectangle as given in the picture. Suppose a circle can be drawn like this. It passes through both intersecting points of the semicircles and touches both lengths of the rectangle. Now the intersecting region of the semicircles is shaded with pink color. Then my problem is what is the area of this pink shaded region? If you want to attempt the problem, pause the video and just give a try. And the solution is right here. First, let's analyze what are given in the problem. First of all, the rectangle has length 4 units. Secondly, the semicircles are identical and placed in such a way that each diameter become one length of the rectangle. And finally, the circle touches both the length edges of the rectangle and passes through both the crossing points of the semicircles. Now remember what is our aim of this problem. It is nothing but to find the area of the pink shaded region. This is the structure of our problem, so always keep in mind. Now observe the figure. Note that it has a horizontal symmetry. So the required area can be calculated as 2 times the area of one horizontal half. Thus we need to find the area of this horizontal half. Next consider this semicircle. Since the diameter is 4 units, its radius will be 2 units. Now consider our horizontal half and draw these two radii to its both ends. Then we can see a circular sector here. Therefore, area of the horizontal half can be calculated by area of the sector minus area of this triangle. Now how to find the area of a sector? There is a beautiful formula to find the area of a circular sector of any size. So take a circle of radius r units and consider an arbitrary sector on the circle. Suppose the angle of the sector be x degree. Then the area of the sector is given by pi r square into x by 360. Now come back to our problem. Here in this sector radius r equal to 2 units. But what is the angle x? That is why this circle is needed in the problem. Before that we need to note an important property of circles. Consider a circle and draw an arbitrary diameter. From both ends of the diameter, two cords are drawn to form a triangle. Then the fact is, it will be a right triangle. Or in another way, the angle made by these two cords will be 90 degree. Noting this point, come back to our figure. Due to the symmetry, the horizontal symmetry line will pass through the center of the circle. Hence, in this circle, this line is a diameter of this circle. Therefore, by the property we told, the angle made by these two codes will be 90 degree. That is, in our semicircle, the angle of this sector x is equal to 90 degree. Now substitute in the formula. It gives area of sector is pi into 2 square into 90 by 360 equal to 4 pi into 1 by 4 that is equal to pi square units. So in our equation, the area of sector is pi. Now what is the area of this triangle? For that, note that this triangle is a right triangle with the perpendicular sides are 2 units each. Therefore, its area will be half into 2 into 2 equal to 2 square units. That means, in our figure, the area of the horizontal half is pi minus 2 square units. Therefore, the required area of the entire pink colored region is 2 times pi minus 2. That is equal to 2 pi minus 4 square units. 
This value is approximately equal to 2.2832 square units. And that is the solution we are looking for. And that's all about this video. My Gmail ID and Instagram ID are given in the description. So if you have any queries regarding the subject, please feel free to contact. And thank you so much for watching. Meet you in the next video with another interesting problem.